In this beginner series tutorial, I'll be demonstrating how to change your wallpaper or desktop background. Here in Windows XP, you right click on the desktop and click on properties, and you see a tab called desktop on top here. This will basically give you a list of uh, different choices for your background, including built in ones that come with Windows XP or previous backgrounds that you might have chosen. Uh, if you don't see something here that you like, click on Browse, which will bring you to a file manager browser, which will allow you to look through your documents, desktop, your pictures folders, to find a picture you'd like to use as your chooses your background. Here is the pictures folder, and you see two different pictures here, so you choose one, and it lists it here and shows you a preview of what it'll look like, and there's different options here that you could choose, but then you click Apply, to actually make that picture your background and then click OK to close this dialog box. I'll also demonstrate in Windows 7 how to do this. So here we are in Windows 7. Uh, it's basically the same procedure. You right click uh, any blank spot on the desktop and click personalize. And then the bottom left here of the window you will see desktop background. So you click on this and this will give you uh, different choices of what to choose for your background. Uh, there's also there's built-in folders for choosing backgrounds that come with Windows. Here it's showing the My Pictures folder and various pictures I have here. Uh, you're able to choose uh, a picture by clicking the check mark once you've hovered over top of a picture. Now if you choose multiple pictures, it allow you to shuffle between them, but if you just choose one individual one, uh, it will show you preview of what it's going to look like on the desktop in the background. Uh, if you check multiple pictures, it will give you the option to basically shuffle through them and change the background anywhere from 10 seconds to once a day. Uh, here you also have the option to either center the picture, if you just want to see the picture in the middle of the screen, or you can stretch it to actually fill the entire screen. Uh, if you'd like to have just one picture as your background, you can uncheck any others, make sure that just one is checked, and then click Save Changes. And this allows you to change your desktop background. There's an additional option uh, to change your background in Windows 7. If you right-click on a picture, any picture you have on your computer, you're able to choose Set as Desktop Background. And by clicking on this, this will change the background to the picture uh, of your choice. If you like this video, uh, please give it a uh, thumbs up below. And also, if you like my videos, uh, I would encourage you to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.